I'm here with MLF Pro Mike McClellan. This is your second appearance in our second world championship. How cool is that? It really is cool. I mean, just the fact that, you know, Major League Fishing has been going for six years now and, and to get to the point that we've got world championships and having the opportunity to be in both of them really is a cool deal. I had to fight and scrape to get here this year, but it feels good to be here. Do you think it almost means more being here this year since you really had to, you know, fight and scratch to get here? I would definitely say so. You know, last year I, I had, or, you know, the two prior years, I had pretty solid finishes and, uh, was pretty certain that I was going to be in. And then last year, it, it was a battle. I mean, going into the second event of the year, I knew I had to make the cut, and I did make the first cut. And uh, when we got to uh, the second lake in the elimination round, I mean, I finally let Score Tracker get to me. I mean, it was one of those first days that I really felt like I spun out, and it was like everybody was catching him, and I'm zigging and zagging and trying to get there. And I really felt like when I left the lake that day, that my chances of making this were done. I mean, I really thought it wasn't gonna happen. And then as the uh, event unfolded and uh, Gary Klein and myself ended up tied, it was like, oh man, what's gonna happen now? And I guess the tiebreaker, I had just a slight edge on him. And so here I am and, uh, you know, I'm sorry for Gary, but uh, it, it, is, it is what it is. Last year we were in Nacogdoches, Texas. Now we're here in Sebastian, Florida. What do you think the fishing's gonna be like? You know, knowing Florida, this time of the year, full moon, the weather has been phenomenal, it looks like, for the last week or 10 days. I mean, it's just evident that these fish have got to be eaten. I mean, it's just Florida, they love it when the sun shines. You know, a lot of other places, the fish kind of like it when the weather's not so nice. But down here, when the sun shines and the conditions are good, they're going to bite. The thing that bothers me a little bit, I'm not a sight fisherman. I don't mind fishing for them when I know they're bedding if I'm not looking at them, but I'm not a sight fisherman and I hope this doesn't turn into a sight fishing derby. Well, best of luck this week in your second appearance in our second General Tire World Championship. I'm ready.